Well, hello again. I'm at Coolangatta Airport, Gold Coast Airport, just behind me there. Bad news is that I've just missed my flight. Bow, bow. The good news is that Southern Cross's Gold Coast campus is literally just over the back here. So, since I've got a bit of time to wait now, I can show it to you. Let's go. Out of the uni, out of the airport, walking out of the airport. There it is, Southern Cross Uni, just this way, around the corner. And there it is. What can you study at the Gold Coast? Well, predominantly the health sciences are here, so nursing, midwifery, dietary, some of the allied healths as well. And you've also got business and education, law, IT. So quite a diverse range. Camp is obviously a heck of a lot smaller than, uh, than Lismore. They haven't got as much space. But as you'll see, it's pretty new. We've got quite a few new buildings up here. A few new buildings anyway. And certainly if you want the lifestyle of living on the Gold Coast, this place is like 400 metres from North Kira Beach. <laughs> it's like one of the best surfing spots in the country. Amazing. Let's have a look. So even students studying up here on the Gold Coast can go and do student exchange programs. Even though the main um, student mobility office is down in Lismore, you still have an opportunity if you're studying up on this campus. That's the library, just a small library space here in Building C. Once again, it is uni holidays at SCU, so a little bit hard to, um, hard to picture what this place would be like when there are actually students around. But certainly, you know, there's this, this will definitely suit a particular type of student, you know, if you already live on the Gold Coast or you really want that kind of Gold Coast life, then uh, obviously having a university right next, next door to you is a massive advantage. And outside of that, I don't know, I really do love the Lismore campus and the community feel there and Lismore is a city, it's bigger than you might, might realise, there's quite a lot that's going on there, so I reckon even if you're thinking about studying at um, SCU Gold Coast, it's definitely worth thinking about maybe taking that same degree down in Lismore just to have that kind of more proper campus vibe and community experience. Don't be wrong, this is kind of cool. Sun setting, beautiful. Right, maybe you just get a little bit more out of the experience of being at uni. So I really like out there in the distance, if I can get the light to work, that's the Gold Coast hinterland. If you're doing up studying here, getting up into the hills there is absolutely amazing. You've got these beautiful hikes and waterfalls and everything like that, like kind of classic Australian bush out there. So definitely go and do that at some point. Only 20 k's away, so definitely worth the time. A few, few beanbags on the lawns. <laughs> Not bad. Nice to chill out here, wouldn't it? Well, that's it. Quick walk around. It really is like a micro campus. Just a small number of buildings. There's quite a few disciplines being taught here. And it feels much more like a kind of get in, get out kind of place. You know, kind of place you get in, get your studies done and get the heck out. And of course, with the beaches nearby, maybe that suits you very well. I just emphasise, yeah, going back down to Lismore, I think. For me personally, it would be a much nicer university experience having the whole campus there for you. Anyway, the sun's going down. I'm gonna go and take my plane. <laughs> Assuming I don't miss this one too. Whatever you're getting up to today, I hope it's a good one. I'll see you next time on Life That Travels. See ya.